In one of the Roblox villages, there lived a kind bear named Winnie the Pooh. He was quite famous among the villagers for supplying them with the most delicious forest honey. And everyone loved him for that very much. Thank you so much! What will we do without you? Time to have breakfast! Oh, I ran out of food. Gotta go to the forest, collect some honey. Good morning, Weenie. Going somewhere? Good morning, Sarah. Going to collect some honey. Watch out for bees! Don't worry, I'll be alright! <laughs> On this quite sunny morning, Christopher Robin headed to Winnie the Pooh's village for the entire weekend to see his grandma, Sarah, his friends, Anna Darlington and Benny Hill went with him to make him a company. Is there anything interesting in the village? Well, Winnie the Pooh lives there. We're not kids anymore. Also, there is an abandoned psych ward. Now that's something. Isn't it, Benny? Oh, yeah. This time the bear's search for honey was not very successful. Winnie the Pooh couldn't find anything, even in the depth of the forest. Where's the honey? Eventually he was able to find the honey, but this was no ordinary hive. Whoa! So much honey! Ouch, ouch, ouch! Without even realizing, Winnie the Pooh stumbled upon the abnormal SCP mutant bees. Oh no, 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 no! Ah! From the bites of this SCP bees, a once cute kind bear began to mutate into an evil bear maniac Pooh. Ran 
Honey! Honey! I've missed you so! These are my good friends! Anna and Benny! How wonderful! What are your plans? Hmm. We uh, will walk in the forest! Oh! Winnie the Pooh just went there! You might meet him! Granny! We're not kids! We don't care about Winnie the Pooh anymore! Well, he'll be glad to see you! I'm going to bake a cake! Have a good walk! I will be here! Mm -hmm. It's so boring here! Well, we'll have fun in the abandoned asylum! <laughs> How much longer? We're almost there. Guys, why don't we go back to the village? Seems like our tabby is scared. Uh, Benny, don't worry. I've been there many times. Uh, uh, what a creepy place. The most interesting is yet to come! Oh. Ah. Whoa! That's what I call a chandelier! doing here he's acting kind of weird weenie what's wrong run No chance we can stop him. We have to call the police. Damn, there is no service here. Let's run to the village. Mm -hmm. Oh, let me go, let me go. Thank you, kind bear! <laughs> While 
the guys were out for a walk, Grandma Sarah baked a delicious cake for Christopher Robin and his friends. Good, everything's ready. <sighs> Granny, you should call the police now. Honey, what's the matter? Winnie the Pooh has gone mad. He attacked us. This can't be. He's got Benny. Oh. Hello, police. <laughs> Benny, you're alive. Hello, what's your emergency? Speak. Um, everything's fine. Apologies for the inconvenience. It's a shame you left. Winnie the Pooh just wanted to offer us some honey. Uh. Bernie, why aren't you eating a pie? Uh, I'm not hungry. Um, 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 Dude, where are you going? Just want to take a shower. Oh. Is he always that weird? Granny, thank you so much. Yeah, that was so tasty. <laughs> I wonder what Benny's doing. Let's see. <laughs> Benny, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just sunbathing. What for? Photosynthesis. What's wrong with you? <laughs> ah. Anna, let's go. Benny's acting weird. I have a bad feeling. During the whole day, Benny simply did nothing except for laying on the grass and sunbathing. Ah. It's time to go to bed. I guess we should all be off to bed too. Uh huh. <laughs> then came the night time, and while everyone was asleep, Something weird started happening to Benny Hill. SCP Beast Honey triggered some irreversible mutation processes in the boy's body, and poor Benny started to turn into a walking flower.
Good morning, Benny. Whoa, where did you get this costume? <laughs> Today is not Halloween. Uh, uh, Ouch, it hurts. Benny, are you leaving? I need to take a shower. They built a new playground nearby. You should go check. Well, why not? Yeah, it's better than sitting at home anyway. Uh huh. <laughs> ha ha. Benny, you want to go check the playground? Is it sunny there? Hmm. Um, I guess. Then I'm going. Benny seems a little strange. Yeah, he keeps taking showers and sunbathing. And also this weird costume. Looks like a flower. Anna, look, these bees are gigantic. Oh no! Benny! Huh? Oh. <laughs> we have to help Benny! Oh God, what's going on? Meanwhile, our old friend, SCP Agent Jensen, was on a scheduled patrolling activity in the Roblox outskirts, in search of traces of different anomalous activities. We located a suspicious anomaly in the nearby village. 
Are we going? Yes, hurry up. Uh-huh. It's like I'm in a fairy tale. And what is this crowd? What happened here? Are you a policeman? Well, something like that. Let's get inside. We have a lot to tell you. Uh-huh. In that cozy atmosphere of Grandmother Sarah's house, Christopher and Anna told Jensen how they met the evil Winnie the Pooh in an abandoned psychiatric hospital. That this evil Winnie the Pooh caught their friend Benny Hill and for some reason fed him with his honey. After which Benny started acting super weirdly. And the next morning, he started looking like a flower. And in the end, he was eaten by gigantic bees. Uh. What did you say? Gigantic bees? Yeah, they were the size of a human. Uh. Excuse me, I need to step away. Restroom is there. Chief, over. I think I might know where the SCP bees are. Good job. Get down to work. <laughs> Meanwhile, Winnie the Pooh's old friend Piglet came to pay the bear a visit. He couldn't even think that something might be wrong. Winnie, open up, it's me, Piglet. Winnie, are you home? I suppose he went to collect honey. So Winnie the Pooh is in the abandoned nut house. Yes. Can you walk me there? Hmm? Uh huh. Great. The bees should be somewhere where the poo is. When are we leaving? Right now. <laughs> huh? I think I lost my way. Here is the hive. Winnie must be somewhere close. Oh, oh! I 
have a bit feeling about this. Just like his friend Winnie the Pooh, Piglet has become another victim of the SCP bees. After their bites, the once pink cutie began to turn into a huge evil mutant pig. Please be careful. Granny, you shouldn't worry. We're not kids anymore. Don't worry. I won't let anyone harm them. The mutant Winnie the Pooh didn't even realize that he and the evil piglet were on the same side, and by his own folly fed him the honey. And since piglet was already a mutant, the SCPB's honey worked immediately. He didn't need any sunlight or water to turn into a flower. So here we are! Hide! Uh. Is that really Piglet? He's also a flower! How terrible! A flower means he should lead us right to the bees. Winnie the Pooh will wait. We should now follow Piglet. And here's the hive. Whoa, it's gigantic. And what is that thing? These bees are dangerous. We have to know what they are up to. And? My SCP scanner has a translator function, including the bee's language. So cool! That's quite cool. Piglet became a flower by itself. Doesn't matter. Let's collect the pollen. What? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh. It came by itself and didn't even resist. I wish it was always like that. <laughs> we go back to the village. I need to think it through. Looks like you know a whole lot about these bees. Yeah, tell us more. These bees are a result of a failed science experiment. 
No, 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 no. The best Roblox scientists attempted to develop a whole new kind of bee species. These giant super bees were supposed to produce much more honey than normal bees. The idea was quite promising. At first, everything went strictly according to their plan. One of the scientists injected the bees with an experimental drug, after which they became larger. And it seemed that the Nobel Prize was already in the scientists' hands. But then, something went wrong. The bees started acting abnormally aggressively and then began to attack the scientists. And from their stings, the best minds of Roblox began to turn into terrible mutants. The SCP Special Forces managed to promptly eliminate the mutants. And the bees? They left the laboratory even before the SWAT team arrived there. So what should we do next? Here's my plan. This cyber bee is able to speak the bee's language. Wow! We'll lure the SCP bees into our trap with its help. Why can't we simply destroy them all? I was ordered to deliver them alive. But why? Professor Bo has to examine them. Well, okay. Setting off, shall we? <laughs> it seems our bees took the bite. Our silly mutant Winnie the Pooh just kept trying to feed the teddy bear with his honey up until the moment he stumbled upon his pot. Then he finally snapped out. The miscreation left the teddy bear, scooped up some honey, and headed towards the village. Right at the same moment, the mutant bees misleadingly flew after the SCP Cyber Bee, which was under Agent Jensen's control. <laughs> 
Okay, now pick some flowers and throw them inside the van. We're done! Good job! They're almost here! As soon as the bees get inside this van, lock the door and head to the base! Understood! Aww. Now hide! While our friends were busy catching the SCP bees, Winnie the Pooh came to the village. And he only had one goal to feed the villagers with his mutating honey. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Hooray, we did it! Now we just have to take care of Winnie. <laughs> Weenie, you're back! And you got your honey! <laughs> Weenie, are you fine? Granny, are you living? I need to take a shower. <coughs> hey, look! Winnie the Pooh! <laughs> I need to take a shower. Oh no! We have to follow her! No. Ah. I need to take a shower! <laughs> Winnie the Pooh fed her the honey! Now she will turn into the flower too! <laughs> she won't if we stop her from having showers and sunbathing! Kido, don't cry! We'll figure something out! <laughs> What's her plan? First, let's get your granny inside the house! I need to take a shower! I need to take a shower. And now what? Our bees are halfway to the SCP lab. I'm sure Professor Bo will create some antidote. Are you sure? 
Well, I can call him and ask. <laughs> oh. Hello, Professor. Do you have the bees? Yes, I'm already examining them. We urgently need the antidote from their honey. Can you do that? Well, I handle the rainbow, friends. I think I can handle the bees too. Good to hear. You have my coordinates. All set. You two stay here and look after your granny. And you? I'm gonna deal with that nasty bear. Queenie, you turned the whole hen upside down. Jensen carefully studied Winnie the Pooh's behavior. The agent concluded that the mutant has rocks in his head and posed little to no danger. The main thing was not to let him fit himself with the SCP Beast Honey. How do I neutralize him? <laughs> Hey, dude, you happen to have a rope? I do. Why do you need it? To mollify this big guy here. But it's fun like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get you the rope. <laughs> hey, are you doing fine? Damn, he ate the freaking honey! <laughs> ah. Professor, what about the antidote? It's done! Please hurry, a civilian started mutating! I'll be right there! I also need a separate helicopter for Winnie the Pooh! Copy! Here's your rope! Listen, did he happen to offer you honey? Oh, I don't eat honey. I'm allergic to it. Well, alright then. <laughs> Very nice throw, cowboy! <laughs> Whoa, what's up with him? <laughs> in less than half an hour, the SCP helicopters appeared in the sky above the village. First and foremost, they had to evacuate Winnie the Pooh. Then, another helicopter landed, carrying Professor Bo with his antidote. Don't worry, it'll fall off by itself. I can't remember anything. Buddy, please help him refresh his memory. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> Professor, we have to hurry to Granny Saras. Ah. Uh. I need to take a shower. I need to take a shower. <gasps> Finally, you're here. 
Uh, uh. Whoa! Where am I? Granny, everything is fine. <laughs> it was the time for a farewell party, but everyone was still haunted by one huge problem. What should we tell Benny's parents? We should be honest, he was eaten by bees. No chance they'll believe us. Do you still have his clothes? Yeah. I think it might have some DNA traces on it. And? And we can clone him. Uh-huh. It's time to get out of here. Yes, I shall not detain you anymore. Honey, you should come more often. I surely will, Granny. <laughs> as soon as he arrived at the SCP Fun's laboratory, Professor Bo immediately proceeded to clone. Benny Hill. Fortunately for Christopher and Anna, the production of Benny Hill's genetic clone was quite successful. Uh, uh. Two drops of water! He's even picking his nose! <laughs> <laughs> they also managed to reverse the transformation of the evil mutant Pooh back into the good bear cup Winnie. Professor Bo's newly developed anti-mutagenic gas helped them with this. And where is Piglet? But none of them could think that the SCP bees managed to continue their line. Ha 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 ha!